So what do you know about Algeria? Probably about as much as us. Yeah, which isn't a huge amount. So we found two super fans to fill us in. Let's start with how you categorise the style of Algerian football. It's becoming increasingly a mixture of technique, skill and athleticism. Players are bigger, they're powerful, and they've been able to use that. And we've been seeing that in the endurance on the African level and on the World Cup level. Have you got a good World Cup song this year? We have one, two, three, Viva l'Algérie. That's our one song, that's what we always say. Just one line? Or one, is the song one that line? Re repeated over and over again. One, two, three, Viva, Viva l'Algérie. That's all it is. What's the media coverage like? Uh, at the World Cup back in Algeria. The Algerian football team is probably one of the few elements that unites the media with this single Algerian thing. Of course, there is a lot of criticism. Why did the coach feel this player? But when it comes to the World Cup, uh, the media is pretty much united. Which players should we be looking out for in the squad? Ben Taleb. The Spurs guy. Only, what, 19, 20 years old? He's a very elegant, great player. Ferruli is the most expensive player in the Valencia team. He ended his season with a goal and an assist. But either from Inter, these three guys with the Brahimi guys in the midfield, man, that will give all the odds a run for the money. It's six to one for you to get out of that group, 28 to one to win, uh, the win that group, and 1,500 to one to win the World Cup. Mm. Is any of those worth a bet? Six to one to get out of that group? Definitely. I would definitely take 600 I think that's good. Group. Yeah. How much? I would put 100 quid on that. 600 quid. You're the fourth biggest outsider. Is that fair, do you think? No, I don't think so. I think there are a number of teams that are, are, are worse than we are. Like who? Yeah. Iran, South Korea, Australia, Honduras. Some really poor squads in there. Mm. I think Algeria, the unknown in Algeria has, has, has had an effect on, on, on the, the, those odds. How many fans go out to the World Cup? Do you know how many? How many support are you bringing out there? Probably, say, 12, 13,000, I'm not sure. Wow, it's a big support. If you do go out, do you have another team that you will follow in the World Cup? Living in England, I would really like to see England advance. But after that, I'm just watching the World Cup just to enjoy it. If it's not Algeria, who's going to win the World Cup? Brazil. Home advantage, they'll definitely win it. The Germans, I think, are the only European team that, that might have a chance of winning it. Who's your dark horse? Belgium. Switzerland, maybe. Switzerland win yeah. the World Cup. I'll take you all out to the risk. <laughs> <laughs> What's the furthest you think Algeria can get? What would be a national celebration? Getting through the group would be a national Getting celebration. Getting through the group would be a huge celebration. Huge celebration. Are you going to stay for as long as uh, Algeria stays? This in the is cups? a very good question because uh, I bought a contingency ticket. So if we make it to the second round, it will be a very expensive happiness. I will have to change my return ticket. I'm taking my father. Now the money, because we're gonna to have to stay for the second round. I'll tell him, we're gonna get it, because we're gonna stay, because it's worth it. Even if we're gonna to have to stay homeless, we will watch it, because we would make it. Well, you just put 100 pounds on them to be six to one. He did, I don't make, no, I don't put yeah, uh, seven really. pounds. I'll put seven pounds on, then that'll help pay for the... <laughs> for the seven seven pounds. Pounds. <laughs> you put seven pounds on at six to one. Yeah. Have you seen the price of the hotel? You've got yeah. 42 <laughs> quid. <laughs> Not sure where you'll stay, Mary. <laughs> What's the score gonna be in the Belgium game? Two one for Belgium. I think we'll be able to get a draw, 1-1. One, one. What's your prediction for the Russia score? Nil-nil. 2-2. Two, 2-2? Two. Two, two. For Algeria. What? 2-2 <laughs> two, two to Algeria. That's a draw. What's the score going to be in the uh, Algeria-South Korea game? 2 nil Algeria. Algeria beats South Korea 3-1 and makes it to the second round. What is it? 1-2-3? Viva l'Algérie. I'm going to be singing that when they score. 1-2-3! Viva l'Algérie! 1-2-3! Viva Algeria! One, two, three! Viva Algeria! One, two, three, four! No, three. Okay. Guys, thanks very much indeed for all the insight. Best of luck. We'll be cheering you on. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck. Thank I hope you. you get really in debt and stay all the way till the uh, final. <laughs> well, those guys seem pretty confident. I said very confident. One of them was very confident. <laughs> very much so. What about you? How confident are you in Algeria's chances in the group stage? Let us know in the comments below. And if you like what you saw and want to see more fan previews, click here. For something a little bit different, click there. Or you can subscribe here. Mmm. I'll have a taste of subscription. Do you want? No. Do you want to try my no. subscription? No.
Just stop it. Stop it. Just one more. Describe it, please. Oh, boy. <laughs> 